In Bentonville, a big relief to rush hour traffic in northwest Arkansas is just weeks away. If you live, work, or even visit the busy Bentonville area on 8th Street, you have experienced that bumper to bumper traffic. The new 8th Street interchange off of Interstate 49 runs right next to the Walmart Technology Center, and employees say getting to and from work is a hassle and has even caused several accidents. Fox 24's Katie Davila is in Bentonville with employees and the city with how they say this project is going to be a big help to businesses. It's big news uh, in this building here, so we're really excited about it. For employees at the Walmart Home Office and David Glass Technology Center in Bentonville, traffic on 8th Street causes a huge headache, but the completion of the 8th Street Interchange Project, a major stress relief. Leaving work every day is the worst part because everyone's trying to leave out of one or two ent entrances on the parking lot on that side, and there's just lines of cars that takes like half an hour to get out of the parking lot. City officials and business leaders in Bentonville say the interchange is part of a bigger vision for the city. Getting more visitors to the area is something Walmart employees are very excited about. It lets people see this building more because there's a lot busier road coming through here, so there are a lot more people driving by, seeing this building, maybe for the first time, and it kind of lets people know that Walmart is a really leading technology company. The driving pattern in this part of northwest Arkansas has changed forever. Danny Stracely with the Arkansas Department of Transportation says the 8th Street Interchange is a major step in keeping up with Northwest Arkansas's rapid growth. It's been a project that's been a long time in coming. Uh, we're just weeks away from opening this up to public access, and I think everybody's pretty excited about it. In Bentonville, Katie Davila, Fox 24 News. Katie, thank you. Weather permitting, Stracely says the interchange will be open by the end of next month. Exit 86 is also expected to open around the same time.